is high school Friday class for Chhattisgarh class 9. Our sub theme for submission is mathematical modeling and computational thinking with the title of exhibiting resistant red or unmitigated threats to wastewater surveillance. Antibody resistance is the pressing global health challenge and requires a multidisciplinary approach. One significant aspect of contributing to antibody resistance is the environmental presence of antibodies stemming from various sources including agricultural runoff, pharmaceutical waste and improper disposal of urban waste. Monitoring the route of antibiotics is the environment is the crucial for understanding the impact, implementing effective mitigating strategies. Resistant data is an innovative digital lab application with integrated image and data related tools which is designed to address this issue of real time tracking of antibiotic concentrations in environment samples while promoting solutions to prevent antibiotic resistance. The present exhibit is an investigative project which is eco friendly, cost effective, and portable, integrated with machine learning, image, and data analytics tools, IoT sensors. Antibiotic data, which is designed with an aim to study the resistance pattern developed by a common pathogen, Associa coli. A common pathogen which can cause a range of disease in humans, animals, has a potential impact on environment. The most common antibiotics like vancomycin, say gentamicin, which are used to treat different serious infections, are reported for losing their efficiency due to antibiotic resistance by common bacteria pathogens like E. coli. The present exhibit consists of three, uh, three integrated phases like segment 1, collection and analysis of wastewater samples from susceptible source of antibiotic resistance. The analysis was carried out with image and analytics, machine learning of wastewater from phenotypic analysis and studying the turbidity of water samples with PCS3200 uh, color sensor and RDUNO. The collected samples were analyzed for susceptible and non-susceptible source of antibiotic resistance with both the methods and screening was carried out primarily on the basis of phenotypic characters like color, suspended particles, etc. and turbidity of wastewater collected samples. The RGB values of PCS3200 color sensor was found from 200, 220, 240, 255 low turbidity with clear to slightly cloudy which indicates potentially lower level of antibiotic resistance and the RGB values of PCS3200 color sensor was found from 100, 120, 140, 180, 220 high turbidity with cloudy to higher turbid indicates potentially higher level of antibiotic resistance. The image analytics machine learning model which has developed with the training of machine with larger collection of image samples is helpful for quick analysis of wastewater unknown samples on the basis of texture and color. By combining image analytics, machine learning and turbidity detection of wastewater samples through RGB well used by color sensors can provide a meaningful insight for a primary screening of samples for potential presence of antibiotic resistance source. Segment 2, lab analytics for antibiotic resistance with culture plate method. The susceptible wastewater for antibiotic resistance was studied in sterile microbiology lab for sensitivity or resistance by E. coli with different concentrations of vancomycin and gentamicin. The culture case was prepared with label concentrations of both antibiotics, vancomycin and gentamicin were inoculated and isolated E. coli from susceptible wastewater sample under laminar flow and incubated at 37 degrees Celsius for 24 hours. After incubation period, the incubated plates were analyzed for the zone of clearance by the treated antibiotic in each seven culture plate. The zone of heat inhibits by the vancomycin and the gentamicin at different concentrations was observed by measuring for inhibition or clear zone on culture plates radius in millimeter and sensitivity and resistance pattern in study. Different values of zone of inhibitions were in observed for the both antibiotics at the different concentration providing an insights on the sensitive and resistant pattern of E. coli. The culture plates were classified on the basis of radius measured for zone of events and put under three classes and resistant immediate sensitive and sensitive for further, further analysis and study. Hypothesis E. coli bacterial samples isolate from the base weight of samples will exhibit very level of antibiotic resistance under the influence of different concentration of vancomycin and gentamicin. The results are the follows. First, screening and identification of wastewater sample source as susceptible and non-susceptible source with image analytics and water sample study with color sensor values by Arduino Uno. Second, selection of wastewater samples for analysis for antibiotic resistance, intermediate sensitive and sensitive on the classes on the basis of zone of innovation under the influence of different concentrations of vancomycin and gentamicin and culture plates. Third, the culture plates were treated with vancomycin antibiotic ranges from 0 to 10 micro mg per ml and gentamicin from 0 to 30 micro mg per ml. Fourth, maximum inhibition is observed at vancomycin is 10 micro mg per ml and gentamicin is 30 micro mg per ml. The radius of inhibition around antibiotic disc is measured in mm in each plate, measured and found three categories for both the antibiotics like first, resistant, second, intermediate sensitive and third one is sensitive with foreign results. Vancomycin. 
zero resistance, one to seventy intermediate sensitive, more than seventy sensitive. Second, gentamicin, zero resistance, one to fifteen intermediate sensitive, more fifteen sensitive. Segment number three, machine learning visualization and data analysis by using meta plot lib, plot lib, graphics, skits, image, and orange visualization. Data obtained were visualized using orange open source software. Second, the data set obtained from both antibiotics under three classes as resistant, intermediate, sensitive, and sensitive, depending on concentration, were imported into the software and trained and analyzed with three machine learning models like random forest, neural network, and SBM classifications. The materials and equipments used in the present investigatory project are waste water samples, e coli cultures, culture plates with medium, antibiotic disc with various concentrations, and microscope slides, cover slip, incubator, autoclave, laminar flow hood, and color sensor with Arduino Uno. Tools which are used in our projects are Arduino software, data analysis and visualization software, Python, Excel, machine learning libraries, TensorFlow, PyTorch, NumPy, Skype Stats, Orange Miniconda. The variables for the present exhibition with the control variables are temperature, pH, color, uh, culture medium, and the independence variables are E. coli bacterial samples isolated from wastewater and the concentrations of antibiotic, vancomycin, and gentamicin. The parameters used in the uh, present exhibit are zone of clearance and zone of colonization, which is bacterial growth. Conclusions and implications. First, what is wastewater surveillance? For studying antibiotic resistance with the integration of modern tools like IoT and machine learning offers several benefits. A. Early warning system detects emerging antibiotic resistance threat. Environmental minority tracks the spread of resistance in the environment and provides insights to improve the hygiene through upgradation wastewater treatment. C. Public health science provides information on community antibiotics use and resistance pattern. D. Target interventions inform strategies to mitigate antibiotic resistance. Our sincere thanks with regard to CSI Neri Nagpur to CSI Jika Sathya Kapital 2024 internship program for acquiring skills to design experiments pertaining to antibiotic resistance and providing necessary literature in understanding the concepts and contents to study antibiotic resistance with integration of modern machine learning tools. Thank, Thank you for watching.